Elegante. Elegante. And you said it pretty much the right way, sir. I'm proud of you. Yeah. That's, that's how you say it, though. I'm putting too much Mexican into you. <laughs> but that's not how you even say it. What do you mean? You say it like this. <laughs> right? No. Or no. <laughs> I mean, if you're like trying to sing ma mariachi, maybe. <laughs> or if you're at a freaking horse race. Whenever, because they, they're so ridiculous. This <laughs> hotel, it's got a freaking arch that you have to drive through to get to it. It's not a bad hotel or anything. It's just, uh... I think you might have told me about that. No, yeah, you know yeah. what? Who told me? My my friend Ruth. Oh, really? Yeah, that she stayed at a hotel over there that was like, you have to go through, like, a bridge or some shit. Is that the one? It's not a bridge, but it's you have to drive under a little arch. They think they're super fancy. And, I mean, it's a nice hotel, don't get me wrong. Yeah. But... It's the kind of hotel that puts the price on the side of the building to try and get people to go. It's... It's very it's not, flashy. Yeah, it almost reminds you of, like, a Vegas hotel. Okay. Not like a, not like a nice one, but like, uh... Harrah's. I don't know if you've... You've not been to Vegas, have you? I mean, I've been through Vegas, but I've never been to Vegas, no. Which, we're going it, one day. It, it reminds me of one of the ones on the Strip, but not like the Bellagio or whatever. So, but it's so fun. It's so stupid, but it's so fun. It's so stupid, it's but cool. so fun. Okay, okay. We'll have to go sometime. I'm down. I was thinking. Uh-huh. Uh, Saturday night, should we get a hotel instead of staying at your cousin's place, or not? I mean, I don't care if you want to. It's up to you. Because we would have to plan that, like, now, so maybe we can get, like, a deal. He might have friends that work at hotels that might be able to hook it up. You think so? Should I ask Just him? that way, we would have more time to ourselves at night. Yeah, I'm down. Well, I don't know. Yeah, ask him if he has any friends. Like, Saturday or Friday night, obviously, we're going to be staying at his place. But And then Saturday night, we can go stay at a hotel? Or something. I'm down. Something. I'm totally down for that. I'm and gonna... you can have my Dang, Girl, you're on video, sir. Well, what? I'm recording my cat, and everything is being recorded right now. Okay, we'll put it on pause. I mean, I could mute this. I'll mute this. What, what were you going to say? But you're not going to put that on any video. No, but but what did no. you say? I was going to say, how much is that Chinese per scoop? Uh, um, a dollar thirty something. Okay, well, I'm going to quadruple it. And you can have mine for 7.30 a scoop. You can have mine. <laughs> Dang. Yeah. I mean, you're the one who eats that. So, like, I should be charging. Because <laughs> you, uh, yeah. Yeah, why well, go get Chinese tonight when I could have your for a dollar thirty a scoop? Daddy, for you, I can be free or on sale tonight. <laughs> on sale? Oh my god. Yeah, I could, I'll give you a coupon. Bad. You want a coupon? <laughs> uh, coupon? <laughs> I have a bunch from whenever I used to do discounts. Uh, yeah. Oh, were you doing discounts for all your customers? Yeah, whenever I used to be a hoe like Trisha Paytas. <laughs> Hello, we have a connection. No, after you pass the grease monkey. Who you calling a grease monkey? And you, sir. Oh, that's rude. <laughs> he just called me 
Oh, that's rude. You Every, call me a monkey. Everything else we've talked about has not been rude, but calling you a grease monkey right now oh, is rude. Charging, charging per scoop for my... That's not rude. <laughs> Kinda. I don't, know about, I don't know about you saying that it's going on sale discount. <laughs> Dang, should I be getting ready right now? Because I'm still coloring. Yeah, I'm almost at your house. I mean, I, I don't look special. I'm wearing what I've been wearing. Well, I'm just going to put on some skinny jeans and curl my eyelashes. Ooh. Or we could go to the Black Eyed Pea. I've never been there. Really? Is it good? It's nothing good, no. Oh, because I've never my, been there. I always see it. My, my papa always used to want to go there. He used to always want to go there? Uh, he, well, they used to have one in Pueblo and we'd go all the time. But... Did you like it? It's okay. Because you said... Them, I don't, what kind we of haven't food been is there... It? We haven't been there in maybe 15 years or 20 years, actually. Dang! Food is <laughs> probably, like, bumping now and hey. you don't even know, huh? But no, well, it's after you pass the grease monkey, sir. Are you not sir, listening? Who are you calling? Who are you calling a grease monkey? You, you're my grease monkey. Change of plans. Huh. We're eating Carlos Jr. tonight. Dang yes. Yeah. I love Carlos Jr. Do you actually want to get that? I would love to. I actually went there the other day by myself. <laughs> I was like... It's really good. I love Carlos Jr. I'm so down. Oh, wait. What about the Office Depot? Do I turn at the Red Lobster Office Depot? No, after that oh, light. Yeah. After that light. Oh, okay. Yeah, the next light, you're going to make a, a left. Mm. Gotcha. My octopus after looks it. pretty crazy. Your afro? My cat octopus. Oh, I want to see her. She. It's a she. Did you, did you give him a p No, I'm doing more like family friendly artwork now. <laughs> There's less than it? Yeah. Uh, I should have. That would have been cool, but no. I see the grease monkey. Yeah, after the grease monkey. I actually got my oil changed there one time. That's where I go. Yeah. I was probably, well, no, this is a few years ago, let's see where I'm here. There's El Gallito. I've is that never, good? I've never been there. Hmm. What does that mean? El Gallito? Oh, excuse yeah. me. The baby chicken? The baby rooster? <laughs> oh. Alright, well, I'm gonna let you go. Uh, I'm almost there, so. Okay. I'm gonna You're finish. Ready? No. Let me just... I'm gonna see your picture and then we can go. Okay, let me color in this tentacle. All right. All right. All right bye. Bye. Uh, I'm right here. Oh, okay. Okay, bye. Bye. Curse to see you laugh, cause I know I'll fucking miss that. How could I forget that? You make me feel alive. Forget the mother bitches, I'll pull them to the side. Anyone who doubts you Life out in Cali as a grain I'm committed You the only thing that makes me wish things were different I might fly you out Get your ass on a one way If I had it my way Girl, you be by my side Get the money, bitches out Put them to the side Girls in LA couldn't be more dry Got some money, baby You ain't even up to try Okay, so... It's a different day. 
you know, I gotta take breaks every now and then because I mean, I make sure we stay focused. So I'm gonna continue coloring for a little bit and then I gotta get ready cause daddy and I are gonna go to Taco Tuesday. It's Tuesday today. We're gonna go to a place in downtown called Lime. And the owners of the place are actually my sister's friends and I didn't even know. And I've been going there for a while. Take my hand and don't you let it go. The glare is kind of horrible right now. I need to rotate my page a little bit to get away from the way the light hits it. But if I rotate it, then I can't really do this part right, if that makes sense. Like, I, I don't really want to continue to smear it also. I feel like I've been smearing way too much. Take my hand and don't you let it go. my shop in there. I just got out of the shower and my arms are kind of humid and I really need to keep them off of the page because then I'm gonna ruin it.
Cause if it takes the guts on the bottom Let's bring you night and take my hand and don't you Take my hand and don't you. This part is gonna be kind of tricky with the way the shading is gonna take place down here. Can you guys even see? Do you guys even get good lighting over there? Or a good picture? Be okay. I have things to say, but I feel like it might be too early. I want to share with the world some stuff, but I don't want to like jinx anything. And I don't know if I should even say anything yet. I mean, I am drawing a black cat, so maybe I shouldn't say anything, right? Damn. Dang, Daniel. Actually, it's damn, Daniel. Damn, Daniel. Daddy actually just showed me that shit today. Well, not today, yesterday. I had never heard that in my life. And I asked Danny about it, and she even knew. I was like, are you kidding me? And Daddy was like, you're gonna say that, and people are gonna be like, what is it, 2015? Or 2005? Five or 15, I don't know. But, yeah, I thought it was pretty funny. Actually, it's not as funny as he made it seem like it was gonna be, but... It was pretty funny. Take my hand and don't you let it go now We'll find our way with the way I shade this, it's literally so messy. Like, I don't even... I try. I'm not going to say I don't try, but... It's very... Like, there is no rule to it. You just do it. I'm so in love with you. We'll be okay, cause if it's us again, so we'll go by. Dude, how many times have I heard this song already? And ask me if I'm tired of it? No. No. And us in anger, take my hand and Okay, so you just asked me if I'm tired of it, and I said no. Now ask me if I know the lyrics to it. Mm -hmm. No. Dang, Daniel. 
Against the world will find it. This is literally just me talking to myself. Like always. Talking out loud to myself. Like a weirdo. So I have to do a little bit of the shading and then after that I gotta go in with the with the dark yellow. So then with the dark yellow, let me give it a little bit of a, uh, 3D-ness look over here. So with this, I'm just like going over the black just for a little bit of blending, you know? And then after I blend it a little bit, then I gotta go in with the black again to make it even darker. So since there's a lot going on in this part of the drawing, this might take a minute. We'll be okay, cause if it's us against the wall, we'll find it. Take my hand and don't you let it go, we'll find it. So this weekend we're supposed to be going to Albuquerque for my cousin's birthday. We are leaving Friday after work. Well, daddy's off, so. But we're leaving Friday after work. I'm trying to get off early. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to. I hope we're able to go, you know, we also have to take the weather into consideration because sometimes the weather here in Colorado is like not cooperative, so if the weather's good and all that, we should be on our way to Albuquerque this weekend. I'm pretty excited, it'll be Daddy and Isis' first road trip slash vacation slash him meeting my cousin and while in Albuquerque I'm gonna be vlogging that daddy and I were talking about vlogging it so those vlogs will probably be out before this is even out or or I don't know. It depends on when I start uploading these videos. I mean, obviously by this point, I've already been uploading. But, you know, in this moment, like, I don't know when I'm going to start uploading these videos.
Probably not till after our trip from Albuquerque. Because I have to sit there and watch them and make sure that they're appropriate. Some parts I have to crop, crop off. Even though I want it to be kind of like real time, I still have to crop a few pieces out because I get phone calls and people talk too much sometimes. And but I don't want to stop drawing whenever I get a phone call, so I just pick up and talk. And of course, Daddy calls me and has sexy things to say that should not be shared in my video for personal reasons, if that makes sense. We'll be okay. Cause if it's us again, so we'll both fight it. As we're united, take my hand and don't you let it go now. We'll find our way out when we are faced with danger. So after I do the, the other layer of black over this, then I'm going to take the blender and I'm going to make a smoothie. Nah. I'm going to take my little blender color and blend the colors together. Okay. So that part's good. Let me sharpen this. Hold on. Excuse me. The world will fight it. Take my hand and don't you let it go. My face went dangerous. So this part is kind of very detailed. Let me zoom in a little bit. It's detailed, so we have to take it a little slow and do it in segments. So that way, um, I'm all burpy, hold on. So that way, it looks a bit more like I actually worked on it and not so like rushed which I tend to make my work look very rushed because I rush through it but I do it on purpose because I like how it looks I do it on purpose because I like how it looks. Plus, I um, I want to get it done. So this part, we can go ahead and start detailing the the suction cups. And they don't even have to look like super perfect because they're so small that uh, it doesn't even make a difference. Actually it does though. Like adding those little 